Did I see that right? Did uh did uh my buddy boy my buddy boy Jeff uh subscribe again at tier one? Thank you, my friend. Thank you. Much appreciated. Welcome. Glad to have you. Man, I wonder why it's taking so long. Anyways, uh thanks for showing up guys. Having a we're having a fine time here. We're about to start some Resident Evil 3. Hello, Jeff. I'm not Jeff. Jeff is Mystic J. Christian Cool is, is who I am, and we are going to play some more Resident Evil 3 as soon as I load up the screen here. All right. Resident Evil. I think we're good. Uh, I think we continue from where we were. Oh yeah, oh yeah, Jeff is mystic for sure. He'll reply back to you eventually. I need to gain my bearings here and figure out what I was doing. I have shotgun, I have this. Some bullets, some other things. I'm going to keep the lockpick on me because it feels like I need that lockpick for a lot of different shit. So we're going to hold on to that. Yeah, who who are you if you're calling Jeff out? Alright, that's it. That's right, we killed one of these stupid things. Alright, eight eight blasts with the shotgun kill this thing. Oh yeah, the game looks good. Granted it's gonna it's gonna be a little short, but um I need to look at my map. Uh map. map. Alright, so we got the lab and we got the upstairs. Ew, so dirty. Damn it. Um, you buy these all digital? Yeah, I bought the Resident Evil games digital. Unfortunately. They had a sweet deal on them. I don't know if they're... They might be available physical. I'm not sure. I have no idea. But they had a... They had a deal, uh... To buy them digitally. So I went ahead and bought them digitally. Gotta save money, bro. Alright. So we're we're gonna find a find a thing here. Okay. 
So we need... Oh, money is something I am severely lacking at the moment in my life. That is what money is. Alright, let's... Let's kill these better. Okay. It's okay, you don't need it. I needed to pay bills. Bills are important, right? Yeah, the mouth is the weak point, so I gotta wait till they open up and then start shooting. Consolidate bills. Less bills, more happy. Uh, the problem with consolidation, it would actually make what I pay now much more expensive. Monthly, I should say. Alright. So we got the we got the lab right here. Take a look around. Battery pack. All right. Oh. Hold on. I need to uh, organize better. Um. I grade gunpowder. This is why we carry the lockpick. He's doing good with the car he's, ha he's had for the last 15 years. Look up debt snowball. Thank me later, friend. Damn, I can't take that either. Yeah, we're going to have to... A love letter. Sorry, but three months of which fled here together, I find myself thinking back to the day you hatched. Your little voices made me tremble with pride. You adorable little bodies, brimming with incredible destructive power, and of course that voracious, insatiable appetite. You are no less than the pinnacle of the Hunter series, and yet they ordered me to destroy you. They said you were unfit to use as weapons because of a few minor vulnerabilities. So what if you're susceptible to heat? So what if your delicate mandibles are exposed when you feed? Haven't they ever heard of character flaws? It's those very flaws that make you so very, very precious to me. But we'll show them yet. Down here, we'll continue to work this evolutionary path together. We'll provide to Umbrella that you, my beloved Hunter Gamas, are truly superior. <laughs> it does kind of come across as something very sexual. I'm not going to lie. All right. We need, uh, I need to come back in here, so. Cause there's a lot of stuff here I can't carry. Yeah, I like the flame rounds. Hmm.
God damn it. Everything I say is erotic. Is it really? Is it really? I don't think so. All right. Let's store you for now. High grade gunpowder. Take you out. We'll store you. Now we got room. Let's save. Um, how, f how far are you into this Resident Evil being only part two? Um, like I said, I got through the first area. I'm in the sewers now. Um, I don't know how big this game is. I don't think it's as, like I said, I don't think it's as big as the original. Um, I don't think it's even as big as Resident Evil 2. So, I think we're probably... At le we're at least definitely a third of the way done with the game already. Wait, did I grab? Did I not grab that battery pack? Fuck! I needed that battery pack, but oh well. I'll come back and get it. Ah, they're all the way right here. Yeah. Alright, let's grab explosive, gunpowder, and herb. There we go. So we found everything here. All right, let's go back to the office again. So we can make some uh, ammo and shit. Yeah, I love limited inventory space. It's the best part of the game. Alright. Um, regular gunpowder with high-grade gunpowder. Combine. Combine. Alright, we got more shotgun shells. Alright, we will combine this with this. Combine. There. Alright. 
store, store, take out, take out. Yes, Jeff knows. Truly unfortunate for him. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> All right, I think we're good. Hell yeah. All right. Figure out where to use that battery pack here. All right, let's go to that. Let's go to that ladder. Has your aim improved? Oh shit! Well, when the target's super huge. Wow, that's much better than the shotgun. Yeah, we'll carry this baby around for a while. Um, yeah, dude, when they open up their... <laughs> what a coincidence, dude. Dead luck, why are you such bad luck, man? Every time you come in here to give me crap, I literally have to deal with crap. It's a never-ending cycle of viciousness. All right, let's, let's use here. All right, that door was locked. Bro, you're the second person who has said that to me today. <laughs> well, it's true. It's terrible, man. Uh, but for real, that nade was way left of the target. I don't want to hear it, Roscaro era. Oh, man. Oh God, no, no, Jesse, don't don't keep doing that. I'm gonna have to hear Titus laugh at me for a while now. No, oh. thank you for the biddies, though. I do appreciate it. Oh my God, why, why? Oh shit! Oh man. Oh man, this guy's dead finally. Oh, come on. Oh man. S oh man. I'm glad you're having a good time, Jesse. All right. So, let's unlock this door. Let's grab the battery pack. Those some tiggle biddies. Oh, on Jill? Hell yeah, man. She, she, she's got some tiggle biddies. God. I can't take this seriously. Oh my god. Ah. Oh. Titus, whenever you're done laughing, dude. Uh, <laughs> I wish I could hear actual laughing. Oh, you can't hear them? There might be a reason. My bad. I accidentally had the desktop audio muted. My bad. My bad. I accident I uh, I muted it right at the end of my last stream earlier, and I totally forgot to unmute it. My bad, guys. 
Aww. It shouldn't be faint now. He's only saying that so he gets more bits. Now I must do it again, so you got to... In oh, come on. Oh, come on. Oh, jeez. Oh, man. Come on. You know... Tinas only finds it funny when people spam my stream of small little bitties. You do realize that, right? He is a he is a complete rude motherfucker. Yuna, you do it like this. <laughs> Dude, I would laugh when I did Yuna too, you know. Man, that is just, oh, uh, you guys are unbelievable. Is it over? Are we done? Is there any more? I think you should stop laughing. <laughs> Thank you, Deadlock. Jeff Weather rather have Lulu. You like that kinky shit, don't you, Mystic? Yes, you do. Yes, you do. All right, let's put the battery in here, see what we got going on. Hey, explosive. There's that pouch I wanted. I got a one next to my name. I'm satisfied. Well, good. I'm glad you're satisfied. I'm happy you're number one. Was that all that was in there? There we go. All right. Let's check over here real quick. I'll probably fall. Watch. Oh, there is no falling. It's just a ladder. Oh, yeah. Battery. There we go. Yeah, yeah, Jesse. Mystic can't do anything without me. He needs my help. But I'm more than happy to help him. Oh, Roscoe era, you rather have Quina? Hey, I guarantee you if someone it Roscoe, if you bid if you put down like over a hundred bits, you'll have your Quina. Just gonna say that right now. You know, I'm not I'm not, you know, advertising I want bits, but just saying. Um, thank you for the contribution, King Deadluck. Whoa. Okay. Ah! Oh. 
Well, that's not what I expected. Whoa. Whoa. Woo. Woo. Oh my god. All right. Oh. Woo. Hey Aiden, what's going on? Uh All right. Um I'm kind of a little irritated because I wanted to I wanted to see what was down here in the sewers. I thought this ladder was going to lead me to the sewer. I was wrong. So, there's something down here that I completely forgot, and I don't know what it is. Hopefully, it's nothing important. Because I don't know if I'm getting back down there anytime soon. All right, we got green herb, got explosive. Um, let's combine this with this and make some explosive rounds. Explosive rounds are fun. We're gonna make another save because just in case. Uh, got plenty of meat for Queena, to be honest. In other words, I'm a fat guy. See, everything's erotica. Oh my god. Yeah, the backdoor dweller doesn't care about gender. Just so, just so you're aware. Yeah. Yeah, Queena will have fun eating you whether or not you're male or female or you're fluid or you have no idea what the fuck you want to name yourself. So... God damn it. I'll just try running up the stairs. Uh, that sounded nasty. Yeah, you gotta get out quick. Out quick. Up the stairs you go. Up the stairs you go. <laughs> Alright, I'm just constantly checking the map map in case I don't see items that are obvious in front of me. I can catch the frogs, so that's so that's cool. Hell yeah, dude. Hey, if you can get all the frogs, Queena would be so happy. God Man, this guy's a douche. Ah! So they replaced the watchtower with this. Okay. Notice of demolition delay. We decided to delay the Barnaby office building demolition in response to ongoing public unrest. For safety reasons, all electrical equipment, including generators, have been moved to the roof for safekeeping. 
Entry to the premises is prohibited until current unrest has subsided. All employees are to stay at home and wait further instructions. Wonderful. I have no other heals. God damn this asshole. God damn. Combine, take that. Oh, he not dumb. God. He's starting to move around now. I'm not a fan of that. God damn, I thought that generator would blow up in his face again. That did not happen. He just wants the shish kebab. Shnish. Uh, he mad. 
Oh my god, it'd be nice if I could aim. My hands are shaking, dude. <laughs> it's hard to aim when your hands are shaking. I don't know, Deadluck. Someone gave it a flamethrower. I'm still fine. Oh, I may not be fine after that. Let's, uh, let's eat a green herb. There we go. And he's just gonna wield it and fucking throw me around. Yeah, let's heal. So yeah, instead of the watchtower from the uh, first game, we get the construction site. Oh my oh my that was a beating all right Carlos it's Jill do you read me loud and clear all right? Yeah. Bastard's dead. Good. Fuck him. What were you thinking? Turning your 
himself into bait. He could have been killed. Don't start. I did what I had to. I know. And thanks. The subway's ready to go. Hurry back. Alright, we gotta head back to the subway station. Make sure it's not. Trying to figure out where I'm at. Handgun ammo. Oh, there's nothing else? Okay. Wonderful. Where am I at? Where am I at? I'm going to check down here real quick. Oh, we're at the police station. Uh, we'll combine that with that. Let's make some shells. Hell yeah. Alright. Yeah, we're at the police station. Nice. Just gotta figure out where to go from here. Explosive, green herb, semi-auto barrel for the shotgun. Now we're fine. Explosive, handgun ammo, gunpowder. Still stuff in here, Jesus. Shit, Jill. Kendo, you're all right. Yeah, all well, right to stretch. Sorry, I got a little jumpy there. Didn't know quite what to expect. No shit. Look, we're using the subway to get people out of town. You in? Subway. Well, that's good thinking. When we get out, there's gonna be a lot to do. We could use a man of your skill set. What's wrong? Nothing. Just a. Uh... Just bad timing is all. Well. Look, um, don't worry about me. I'm gonna make other arrangements, okay? You better. You're the best gunsmith around. Oh, no. <laughs> don't do anything stupid. Oh, that's, that's your job, right? <laughs> Take care, Jill. If you're heading to the station, take that... Service alley out in front of the shop, okay? The key's hanging on the wall. Alright, interesting. Yeah, you run into that Kendo guy in the second game. Yeah, in the second game, you find out that his daughter's pretty much bitten and she's becoming more zombified. And uh, he's not willing to leave her. So... Oh, 
Oh, there is a box here. Okay. Um, let's store this. Take out that. Combine this with that. Combine with that. Store, store. And take out. Let's save for now. I do like, you know, I know in the original game you do overlap certain areas. The police station was like one of the big areas you overlapped in the original game. Granted, in the original game, there was a certain couple areas you went to that you don't go to here, so. Alright, I think we got everything in here. Yeah. So we take this gate, and we'll be good. Hopefully. <laughs> what? G Caves, what's going on, my dude? Glad to have you. Glad to see you hanging out with the rest of the cool kids. Hope your Monday's been well, dude. Oh, get out of here, dude. Oh, man, there's weird, weird motherfuckers here, too. Discard this thing. Uh, hope you're well, D Caves. Hope you're well. This isn't the safest alley. Yeah, I'm aware. Holy shit! Get off! Alright. Let's look at the map. We'll go this way. Oh, it's one of those things. I don't like how she swings a knife. She fucking runs her fist into it. It's like, eh. Not a fan of that. I have so many in inappropriate jokes for that monster. You really wonder if they designed that monster just for people to have jokes. Oh my god, more... I'm going to check the upstairs first. Raccoon Times Reader's Column. Dear Editor, I'm writing to you because I'm troubled, deeply troubled. Anyone who's been a parent knows that Crystal Promenade is the place to take your kids to for a trip downtown on Saturdays. There's no store more popular or harder on a parent's wallet than Toy Uncle. However, I noticed that on windy days, the big statue above the entrance wobbles like the only thing holding it up is a couple of screws. If that statue's head tumbles loose on a busy day, children will be hurt. Will be badly hurt. I've complained to the manager three times now, but he just isn't willing to rectify the situation. Are we supposed to wait for a terrible accident to happen before taking action? No. If the heads are going to roll, then let it be the manager's. Take that death trap down. All right. Definitely on purpose. Developers love adding adult things in games. I know. They try to add... A lot of... Uh, some developers do like to add as many innuendos as possible in fucking games. To see if people will, you know, catch on or even see it. Alright. I don't think there's anything else in here.
Oh, come on! <laughs> For the love of God! Really? Oh, my God! Shit! I got a funny feeling what I'm about, what I'm gonna have to do. All right, first of all, let's take some first aid spray. So we're gonna need it real soon. Second of all, I got a feeling I read that article in the paper for a reason. There's the head. back to where we were before. Nice. fun i like dying to big you know you know big giant heads that's awesome all right give me a moment guys before we start going again i gotta use the restroom real quick and stuff like that so we'll take a quick commercial break um and then we'll resume what we were doing here i'll be right back guys Encounter the enemy requesting backup. Just encounter the intruder. Send in the search team. Oh, 
I need some help here. Some backup gear. It was nothing. All clear. The situation is normal. All clear. Send additional personnel. nothing all clear i just got rolled over by a really big giant toy head so <laughs> what yeah oh. the nemesis blew up a big giant toy head above the toy store where i was at and it rolled me over encounter the enemy requesting backup it was rude All right, I'm back. Um, like I said, had to do a few things around the house. Figure I would um, real quick before I could come back. Uh, 
So I didn't expect that toy head to run to kind of just, you know, roll over me. I kind of figured it had been something I would use against the nemesis. Not something the nemesis would use against me. Not, not a fan of that. So let's go ahead and continue. Keep moving no matter how strange the situation may be. <laughs> All right, let's do this. All right, I gotta start running. Oh, he's behind me. Wonderful. What a dick. Out of here. All right, let's go. Fuck that guy. Carlos, I know we didn't get off to a great start. Thanks for the save. Hey, you saved my ass first. You're a hell of a lot braver than me. Well, what matters is that we can get everyone out of the city now. Yeah, and you'll be safe. What about you? Not from the sound of it, I won't be catching the train. Why not? No, oh, there'll be new orders. If it means I can help save the city, it's fine by me. Oh yeah, we go this way. All right. Your reputation is well deserved. Get inside. The subway is about to leave. Carlos, Tyrell, you have your orders. You need to go back out into the city and find Nathaniel Bart. This isn't the last man out of town, right? Do not worry. Once the civilians are safe, the train will be back. It's all right. You're going ahead. But I'm not going to die on you and leave you in a cold, cruel, Carlosless world. <laughs> okay. You'll need to find this scientist. His vaccine research could save us all. You see? You're learning. The only life that matters is your own. Good luck. Let's go!
You don't really think a pencil pusher like Barrett is still alive, do you? I have a done good authority. Uh, uh, why? Uh, are you worried about teammates? Archerverse, you cannot ban me on my channel. No matter how hard you try, I will remind you every day. It does not work. Funny how brainless zombies can ambush a platoon like that. No. Funny the gate was locked. Don't you think it? <laughs> How is this fucker not dead yet? Just no, they're gone. Come, this way. Nikolai, what are you doing? It's not after you. <laughs> Nikolai! What a dick. Holy shit. Subway's got to be clear of the city by now. Along with your hot date? Nah, she's not like that. Hell, she's not like anybody. Hmm. Be right back, shower time? All right, Archer, I'll still be here. Oh, they're at the police department. All right, keep your head screwed on, Romeo. This is the police station. Ooh, I get to play as Carlos? Interesting. Are you sure? It looks like a cemetery to me. Brad, stop! T. You too. Sorry. Sorry. Ah, shit. Also, this happened before Resident Evil 2. Because when we get to the police station, that black uh, policeman guy is uh, hurt. You stay on the door. I got this fucker. ID card. These stars. That could be useful. Email out box. Department in chaos after spread of infection. Multiple citizens take refuge here infected. All files ready to you successfully disposed of, awaiting further orders. Communications intercepted from S Hospital on Star's private communications line. Presumed to be evac request from B. Possible he will flee the hospital and come here. Request UBCS dispatch. I will evacuate with their assistance. Request the evac has not yet arrived. This position is becoming untenable. I remain here with the condition my safety would be guaranteed. If I am left to die here, I will distribute proof of collusion and corruption between you and RC civic leaders. You have one hour to deliver a response. Sorry, poster boy. 
Somebody didn't have time to put his blues on. Huh. Huh. Hi. What? Can you mute them for a second? Hmm? Can you pause them for a second? What? I had some other garbage disposal. We had to use the garbage disposal in the kitchen, so uh, it it gets picked up by the mic pretty easily, so we uh, didn't want that to happen. So this, the events of Resident Evil 3 happened just prior to the events of Resident Evil 2, which is kind of cool. Where'd that cop go? Don't know, don't care. We got a job to do. If our intel's still worth a damn, then Bard's in the star's office. Let's find him and take him into custody. Custody? I thought this was a rescue. All right. Let's go ahead and figure out where we want to go here. I've located the star's office. Remember, Bard had access to Umbrella's darkest secrets. He knows we'll try to keep him under our thumbs. So this search and rescue mission is really more like find and detain. Hmm. Right. Good to know. I'll open the shutter so you can get through. You stay here and find out what's been going on here at the station. Call you if I find anything. Hey! Be careful. Yeah. You too, man. Alright. New data. Honestly, you don't get the really... The only time you play as Carlos in the original game is when Jill gets infected. Alright, you want me to keep out? I'll keep out. So it's kind of weird that we're playing this part of Carlos. Here's a weird fucking door. Leave it. We're here for Bard. Hey, nice. Each member of the force been issued an ID card. From now on, the same card will be required to access all storage boxes. Do not lend your card to anyone. Take great care in using it. If your card goes missing, report it lost immediately. Wonderful. You know what? I want to check upstairs real quick. See if there's... Area looks clear. Must be on the other side. There's an item up here, but I don't know which side it's on. It must have been the other side.
It was just handgun bullets, nothing more. Alright, let's save it one more time so I don't have to run around and get that shit again, just in case. Oh man, we got liquors in here. Ooh, he just got strung up. Anything super awesome. Right. Big warm RPD welcome. Tony, what's going on, dude? Good to see you. Uh, we're uh, playing some Resident Evil 3. We're in the police station, and it's kind of cool how they tied this in with the uh, Resident Evil 2 remake. All these events happening before the, the events of the second remake. you played these before, right, Tony? Uh, you only played the OG Resident Evil 2 only? Well, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not saying you should ever, like, go back and replay the old ones. But you should definitely check out these newer ones. These newer ones are a lot of fun. T, you copy? There's something real nasty in here. I don't know what it is. Something nasty? Alright. I'll take a look with the cameras. Watch your six. All right, let's do this. God, there's so many. Mm. 
Fucking die, Jesus. How you feel about the Resident Evil movies? The movies suck, dude. The movies are terrible. Don't ever watch the movies. <laughs> Bust that knife out, dude. If you if you think I can aim with the knife better than with the gun, then you're out of your fucking mind. <laughs> Uh, yeah, the movies suck, dude. I hate the movies. Absolutely hate the movies. Whoa! Shit! I didn't even hear that guy. My TV volume's a little lower, and then the, there's the noise in the kitchen, too. So I didn't hear this guy worth a shit. Go down. The first one wasn't... The worst movie, but the problem is they ripped off Night of the Living Dead, uh, Romero's film, so bad and so obviously that it was just like, it didn't feel like a Resident Evil movie, it just felt like a really bad modern zombie movie, and it annoyed the crap out of me. Hold on. Alright, so yeah, that's that was the thing about those films. Sorry, I had to talk to my girlfriend. But uh, I just didn't like the films. The films were garbage. Yeah, sure, she did the best job that she was giving. Like, like the films are what they are, but like, being a big Resident Evil fan, you know, you kind of expect the films to be something, and they were just like their own thing, like... It's like they took the source material and made their own, like, universe. And, you know, I, I just... It didn't sit well with me. Like, I didn't mind her role. I didn't mind her acting all that all that much. But it was just everything around her I didn't really care for. I can't believe they made six movies out of the fucking shit. That's what blows my mind. Great. I need a key. Scope on the assault rifle. Nice. Let's combine some shit here. Yeah, I don't remember what the found or what the combination is that safe. Ooh. Rodney Gray. Unlawful creation or possession of explosives. Suspect was seen behaving suspiciously at 1442 at Box Tree on September 18th. Suspect's person was searched. Producing a small explosive and a time detonator from his inside pocket. Leading to arrest on the charges listed above. A search of suspect's home found more than 20 additional homemade explosives at various stages of completion. Suspect was extremely agitated and not of sound of mind. Not of sound mind. Suspect spoke feverishly when questioning began and at one point questioning had to be halted due to a sudden bout of shrieking from suspect. Once questioning was resumed, suspect made the following statements. I didn't do it for me, I did it for you. Why doesn't anyone understand the corpses attack from the shadows? A storm's coming, that this umbrella is no good. Gotta blow it up or you'll be or you'll you'll be more than just wet. Gotta get more bombs. They're coming soon, gotta hurry. Burn them, burn the corpses, burn them good. During questioning, the suspect began, began to shake violently before resuming a shrieking fit. Questioning was ended and a sedative administered. 
Due to suspect's unstable psychiatric condition, suspect's testimony changed from moment to moment. His uh, delirium made any sort of dialogue impossible. We are currently awaiting the results of a doctor's investigation to his condition. The explosives collected from his person and residence appeared to be extremely powerful. As a safety precaution, a battery was removed from one detonation device upon admission into evidence. The battery was secured in the safety deposit room. Wonderful. Ooh, there's a red herb. Alright, let's combine this. All right, where else we gotta go? Yeah, we got the safe. Let's go in the dark room. Down, boy. Down, buddy. Um, okay, this is the uh, combination. Left 9, right 15, left 7. Well, if cameras killed those things, I'd be set. Assault rifle. Red herb. Uh, let's put the let's put that in there. We'll keep this. All right. Oh, you're up. Kind of fucked up shooting cops. Yeah, it's a little fucked up, but it is what it is. Left nine, right fifteen, left seven. Shit. Right 15, left 7. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Hip pouch. Gimme, give gimme. Give Alright, we gotta go upstairs. gonna say please tell me this guy's not up again but I'm glad he's not up Carlos the star's office is up ahead copy that yeah we want to get to the star's office all right Wait, yeah, there's nothing ahead, so we go in here. Green herb. I 
I got a bad feeling about this. Hector, if you're reading this, I'm already dead. If you're any noises coming from the locker, do not open it, please. While you were out on patrol, I focused on finding a way to get to the other side. I realized the explosives might be our best bet. I managed to rig up a pretty good bomb, but we don't have any batteries for the detonator. I'm pretty sure I sent one to the safety deposit room during the intake last week. We need that battery if we're going to knock this wall down, so head upstairs to find you since I know you have the safety deposit room key. As soon as I left the shower room, I was attacked. One of them bit me. I washed the wounds best I could, but I feel worse and worse. I, I hope I don't need to spell out what... Why you must not open the locker. Please don't worry about me. Just get yourself out there as fast as you can. Your buddy Wes. Don't worry about that 600 bucks I lent you. Think of it as a gift towards your upcoming move. Good luck, buddy. All right. That dude is dead. Better not. Um, are you talking about me? Okay. Guess we'll be doing this the exploding way. All right, so I need the battery. Oh, the person who wrote the note? Yeah, he, he very dead. He's in that locker right here. Yeah, he's very dead. You said you played both of these, right, King Dudluck? He. Yeah, I don't know that one. Nah, I only played the beginning of Resident Evil 2. Gotcha. I don't know, man. These games are fun. I love them. I do love these games. I just gotta get some balls and play the the later ones. Yeah, there's another combination for that one, I'm sure. Oh, yeah, that's right. In order to continue on the third floor, this wall was out. I'll get back to it someday when my backlog's like crazy. I hear you, dude. All right, so we need to blow up the wall to the shower room. We need to get in the safety deposit room. I just don't know what I need. Oh, there's more stuff in the West office. Ah, uh, Deadlock. Deadlock wants to hang out with Sonic, and that we will do. Hell yeah, Sonic. Lots of friends want to hang out with you. There you go, buddy. Fist bump for you and fist bump for the all the rest of the cool kids here. All right. Hell yeah, dude. So I got some other plushies in mind that I want to get. First of all, when it comes out, I want to get the angry video game nerd plushie. I, he's like, he, I don't know if it's a plushie or if it's like a figurine, like a, he's supposed to be like a four and a half inch figurine of sorts or whatever, but I want to get the angry video game nerd, um, figurine when it comes out. It's supposed to come out later this month. Whoa.
One asshole. Is it blocked? Oh yeah, and uh, like I said, I want to find some other like Final Fantasy plushies and stuff like that that I can use. Maybe get a like a, some Mass Effect plushies. So we're gonna go ahead and save right here before we move on because I'm not sure where we gotta go next. I think I might have missed something. Okay, that was mean. Ouch. Ninety-nine. Apparently there's something else in here I forgot. Trying to look around and see why I might have forgotten, but I don't see why I would have forgotten. Because it still shows as red. Like, is there something I'm missing? Oh, right here. All right, that it? All right. So I got to make it back to the main hall or something because this door's locked. I have no way to open it. Probably gonna deal with more of those assholes out this door. I imagine. Or not. Well, that was fast. Don't tell me you chickened out. Oh, shit. That key's to the room. I had the key. Fuck. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. I totally forgot I picked that stupid key up. Alright, let's go back in there. I didn't chicken out, idiot. I just forgot I had the key. I thought I had to get somewhere else. Guy's a dick.
use. <coughs> Yay, it works. One oh four. Whoa. Alright, so which ones? 104, 106, 109. Let's do it. Combine with that. Uh, discard this because we don't need it anymore. Mine now. Come to Papa. Come to Papa, he says. All right, there's probably, ooh, DCM. Lurking while I do the dishes, and yay, Resident Evil 3. Thanks for the lurk, cat. Good to see you. Cat redeemed to hang out with Tails. Let's get Tails in the picture. And Tails is hanging out with everybody here. Alright, Tails. Fist bump. Fist bump for Sonic. Fist bump for the rest of you guys. All the cool kids hanging out having a good time. All right, so we uh, we did just save. There's probably a monster out there. Let's get ready to die. Heading to bed in a bit, but I got you tabbed up in uh, my dude. With the lurk, thank you, Bone Shark. I appreciate it, my man. Hope you had a wonderful Monday, and uh, we'll speak again later on in the week. Hopefully, we'll talk about great, wonderful games. All right, go to the third floor locker and hit up that uh, that combination. There we go, we got it. Assault rifle, nice. Carlos, I've hit a dead end with the terminal here. Gotta head your way. Copy that. All right. Yeah. 
I couldn't back up anymore. Fuck. One at a time, take a number. God damn. Holy shit. Ah, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Oh my god. I'm not gonna lie, I did not expect 10 million zombies right there at the end of that door. Yeah, I know. Ouchie's right, Fancy Cat. One at a time, take a number sarcasm and snark aren't as good as headshots, apparently. I know, right? Did I open that locker? I gotta double check if it let me open the locker. No, it did not. All right, now we know what's uh, behind door number one. We need to be ready for him. Well, Carlos, I did a dead end with the terminal here. Got to head your way. Copy that. All right. Um, let's go ahead and. Yeah, I can't really save it. So, let's hope this works. Gotta move. Anybody else? Anybody else want some? One at a time, take a number. Well, yeah, it's even cooler to say it when you kill everybody. That grenade was well placed. I'm not going to lie, guys. That was well placed. I couldn't do that again if you asked me. I'll take some first aid spray. No problem. Ah! Shit! How'd you survive that? God's dumb. How'd they survive that? Ah!
God damn. God. Jesus. Hopefully there's no more. Jesus Christ. All right. Star's office it is. Here we go. Dr. Bard. Oh, thank God. Do you know how long I've been trying to reach somebody? Don't worry, we're gonna get you out of there. Just tell me where you are. I'm trapped in a goddamn hospital, surrounded by every kind of abomination. Look, just send in stars. They're gonna know what to do. No, I'm negative. RPD's overrun, too. Then figure it out! Umbrella's gone crazy. They're killing all the researchers. I am the only one who knows how to make the vaccine to stop the zombies. So you can either sit there with your dick in your hand or send, send somebody who's capable of getting me the hell out of here. I like him already. Yeah, you would. You heard what he said. We can't turn him over to the company. Well, that's not our call to make. That's Mihail's call. I'm gonna check the computer, see if I can trace the doc's location. This will take some time. Look around, see if you can find anything useful. Yeah, I'll take a first aid spray. I used that green herb. I should have had that with the red herb. Fuck. Oh well. Got another red herb that's about as useful. Report on the mansion incident. A bizarre incident occurred in a mansion owned by the Umbrella Corporation located in the Arclay Mountains. On July 23rd, Bravo team was dispatched to the mountains to investigate a series of mysterious and grisly murders that went unexpectedly radio silent. On 24, Alpha team was dispatched as well and became entangled in the events of the nearby mansion. The incident culminate, culminated in the destruction of the mansion. Casualties were numerous. The only survivors were five members of STARS. This ca this ca the cause of the incident was the illegal bioweapon experiments being carried out in the secret umbrella lab beneath the mansion. The T-virus being used in these experiments escaped the facility. It is presumed to be the root cause of all that occurred. However, all evidence was destroyed along with the mansion, so further investigation has proven to be extremely difficult. Is that Jill in the front row? That all there is in here? Hell yeah, that's it. It's just a box. And we can dispose of this thing now. All right. I guess I gotta leave in order to move the game along. Yeah, what's up? Is anyone hurt? Jill? Ah, oh, shit. Wait, what? Jill! Jill, what happened? Jill, come in! T, I gotta go. 
Do what you gotta. I'll take care of Bard. Interesting. All right, I'm going to take a drink of my water here. Am I the only one who made it? No. No. Looks that way, Jill. Back in the sewers. UBCS new weaponry notice. Mine rounds. These baby were developed by their art and they'll light your fires even higher than the lover you left back at home. Tough hand, tricky hand, oh, trust me, they're worth it. They're designed for standard issue grenade launchers. Don't get cute and try to load them in anything else. Fire them at walls or the ground. They'll stay right where you are, right where you put them. The sensor in the mine will detect approaching enemies detonate when they get within range. Nice. Oh, well, if we're going to be out or down in the sewers again, I might as well just store the shotgun and get the grenade launcher. Save. Dilapidated shelter. Make sure nothing on these beds or anything. Oh, that thing's got to die. Alright, let's go up the stairs. It's 
Stay down, asshole. Right. Moving along. Oh, there is a clock tower. Did I put that red herb in? I must have. And we got red herb. Alright, we'll combine those with that. I just make sure we didn't open that. Train derailed. Derailed? Was anyone hurt? No, everybody's dead. Mihail, everybody. Oh, shit. Nikolai left us to die. Wait, what? What the fuck? Oh. It's back. Oh, God. Ah, oh, I know, right? She's just like, ah, oh, that bitch can't fucking swim. Showed her. Trying to get some shit. Damn. Oh, that's all shotgun shit. I didn't bring my shotgun shit. It never ends with this thing. Oh, I know, dude. It's the same way in the in the OG third game. It follows you around everywhere. All right, we're not super hurt yet.
Damn, I missed. All right, combine with you. There. Let's heal. Let's heal. Fucking asshole. Where'd he go? I wish I had shotgun shells. Damn it. Okay, that hurt a bit. Make sure, okay, we probably got all the ammo. All 
All right. It's too hard to hit while it's moving. God, how many more fucking my rounds this thing gonna take? Okay, that hurt. My God, like, I should have brought my shotgun or something. Jesus, I didn't realize we were going to have this problem. I barely have any ammo, barely have any health. I don't know what I'm supposed to do against this thing. At that point, I might as well have taken the L because I didn't know what to do. All right, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to load game. So I want to bring the shotgun with me. You don't...
All right, we're going to try this. All right, let's see if we can kill that asshole now. that worked all right now we just gotta do it one more time upstairs there we go Damn it. The red and a green herb. God damn it. There we go. At least I can combine on um, pickup. That's good. I was going to be a little worried if I couldn't combine on pickup. crazy round two There we go.
Oh, that was mean. Ow. Yeah, that was not nice. Oh, inv in inventory's full. Hold on. Green herb full. Okay. Go. That's what we do. Archerverse, redeeming Knuckles. Let's go ahead and get Knuckles out. You guys like to make sure you get all the trio out. I appreciate it. Alright, Knuckles is hanging out with the rest of the cool kids. Fist bump, fist bump, fist bump. Oh, fucking fist bumping. Why, why, why does it hurt every time I fist bump knuckles? God, that guy's a prick. Fist bump with the rest of the cool kids. We're hanging out. We're trying to kill this motherfucker. Motherfucker won't die. He's like a rabid dog. I know, AM. It's it's annoying. He won't stop. Alright. 
We're not dead yet. He looks Superman now. Catch up with the chat a little bit. Um, oh, you're off for the next two days? Good. That's good to hear, Archer. You usually have the two days off during the week anyway, so. Just stopping in before I do my thing. Hell yeah, dude. Hell yeah. Now I gotta figure out how to kill him without any more fucking uh, mine rounds. Fuck! Alright, let's eat this green herb. Oh, that hurt. God damn. I thought I was doing well. I thought I was doing that, but whatever. All right, so I got to be a little more clever with the mine rounds. I can't be using the mine rounds when he's stunned. I have to use them when he runs around. Yeah, the rabid dog nemesis said fucking no. He said no to that. You do not take me down. You will not make me pass go. Yeah, this guy's a real dickhead. I'm not a fan. Like, I'm trying to fucking do this correctly, and he's just being a... He's he's not cooperating. He's non cooperative. That's that's what we're seeing here. Alright. Come on. Hi, asshole.
Pimento checking in. Good to see you while I'm getting my ass kicked by the nemesis. Oh, I'm trying to kick its ass, Sparkles. Trust me. Um, it's had the better of me a couple times already. We're trying not to let that continue to be a trend. Inventory's full. Well, why don't we fix that? There we go. Right, let's do this. Suck it. <laughs> Suck it. <laughs> so nineties, I like it. Carlos, you still there? Oh, come on, you're gonna crap out on me now? God damn it. Um Looks like you were just making it mad. I was making it mad. I was making it very mad. I gotta make sure I got all the ammo and shit that's sitting around here. Before I go on. I thought there was another thing of shells I could get. Oh, okay. There it is. There's the mine rounds. Can I not combine? Really? How about if I combine that with that? Oh my god. There we go. We'll grab that. Oh! 
done me a big favor. Miss. Wow. Guy's fucked up. Jill. Hey, answer me. God damn it. Tyrell, do you copy? What's going on? Jill's been infected. I I'm taking her to the hospital. Maybe Dr. Barr can save her. All right, I'll meet you there. Yeah, I know, right? Good game. Woo! Fire, fire, fire. You hang in there, super cop. I got you. Man. Twitch hasn't reapproved my fire emote yet. That's kind of annoying. They're like severely lacking on that. The queen of stream, it is Sparkles. Yes, it's good to see Sparkles here. Life been good. Life been good for you, Sparkles. I hope it has been. It has Why not, but it's getting there. Just trying to stay positive. Well, I figured with like. I'm gonna get you the vaccine. All right, he's gonna get her a vaccine. So let's go ahead and. Gonna be okay. Is this a save room? It is a save room. You know, I figured with you getting, you know, new surroundings, new things going on in life, you know, relocating, I figured things would get better. How come? Uh, how come it's not been so great? All right, let's. Uh... We'll save here. We'll save here. It's fine. All right. So, truth be told, it's almost 11. And we'll just kind of close out the rest of the segment. We'll just chat a little bit. And while we're chatting, I'll find someone who is worthy of a raid. So, I'm glad you guys uh, decided to hang out with my friends today. My friends are super, super awesome. Um, I hope things get better for you, Sparkles. I really do. Um, you're, uh, you're a much more um, awesome presence when you're up and about smiling and streaming. Um... Raid Timbo Slice Gaming? I suppose I will. Alright. Let's go ahead and raid Timbo Slice Gaming. I gotta load it up on my uh, thing here. All right, Timbo Slice Gaming's playing some Final Fantasy X. That's interesting. Um, he's also, uh, you know, seems like he's a small-time streamer. We're gonna give him some love, and uh, we're gonna go hang out with him. Um, it's nice hanging out with everybody. I appreciate it. I like doing these night streams, you know, on occasion to kind of, you know, play stuff I don't normally get to play. So, thanks for supporting. I'll see you in the morning uh, to play Mass Effect, and let's go check out Timbo Slice. Since so you know, I always listen to the console of Oh Sparkles. Oh my. Oh yes. Alright. Let's give this guy some love, drop some emotes on his ass, and uh, let's, show up, let's show him that we enjoy some games as well. So, I'll see you everybody. Take care. <laughs>